Hello, I'm James. Today I'm going to be talking about making your web content more accessible. In the excitement of creating and sharing content, we don't always stop and think about how accessible that content is, especially for those who experience the web differently due to disabilities. Many people with visual impairment or reading difficulties rely on screen readers to help them while they are reading stuff online. Today I'm going to be looking at hyperlinks, good practice for hyperlinks, uh, some examples of bad hyperlinks and what we can do to make them more accessible. So here's the first example of a bad link. When hurrying to get a post out, it's very easy to simply copy and paste a URL link like this one here. It's not the friendliest link for anyone reading it, but it's even worse when using a screen reader. Here, this is what it sounds like. Here is an example of a bad link. Visited link HTTPS slash slash d2 liters dot deacon dot edu dot o slash d2 liters slash home slash 668,195 ga equals 2.126517 Pretty awful, right? It's always a good idea to hide the URL in the HTML and instead have some descriptive text letting people know where the link takes them. Here is another example of a bad set of links. Now just at face value, it's not clear why this would be bad. But often, people using screen readers would navigate through a page by jumping from link to link. Think of it like skim reading. If I were to navigate through these links, it would sound like... Here is an example of a bad link. List with three items, click here, visited link. Click here, visited link. Click here, link. Also not very helpful. So what makes a good link? A good link uses descriptive text rather than a URL or a click here. The descriptive text is concise and describes exactly where the link goes. So don't make it too long either. Ensure that your link makes sense out of context. If I had to just read this text right here, would I know exactly where the link goes? You don't need to include words like link or click in your description. So remember, keep your links clear and descriptive, and keep your media inclusive.